crunch wrap. Let me show you how I make mine. So get your ground meat, preheat your skillet, cook your ground meat all the way. Once it's cooked, I'm adding my taco seasoning. It's my homemade taco seasoning. I'll have the full recipe at the end of this video. If you are interested, you can go and watch it. Now add a little water. Give a good mix. It's almost there. So set aside. Now let me start getting my tortilla. I'm using low carb. Tortilla, get a large one. Get your refined beans, ground meat, sour cream, lettuce, tomato. I'm using cherry tomato, it's so much easier to handle them. Cheese, and let's start folding it. Now I'm going to fry them in the frying pan. It's preheated, the skillet. Spray. Spray it on the top. Flip it. Oh boy, it looks so good. And there it is. Let me show you, I'll cut it in the middle and show you how it looks. You can eat it, eat it with the salsa, avocado, guacamole. There it is, guys. It tastes so good. Here's the recipe for homemade. I'm going to make my own homemade taco seasoning. Doing so, you, I'm avoiding MSG, fillers, sugar. So here is the recipe. It's so easy. It's not only it tastes better, also it's good for our health. So think about it and give a try. Okay, paprika, one teaspoon. Onion powder, half a teaspoon. Red chili flakes, one teaspoon. Salt and pepper. Oregano, one teaspoon. Give a good mix till it's well combined and there you have it your homemade taco seasoning what i do i put it in the bottle and i store it so i this way i can use it next time when i need it thanks guys